All right, so we're about to test some things. Last pull on this dyno, but we got a ported intake ready, JLT, bigger throttle body, car, and uh, we're gonna test it with the best stock combo Hellcat airbox setup I could possibly get. Uh, gonna do some pulls to baseline it, swap the JLT on, and then um, baseline that, then put the intake manifold on, baseline that. If the air fuel changes at all, just add a little bit with the handheld just to get the air fuel curve back right. Not gonna touch the timing. And then uh, I'll swap the bigger throttle body on and see if that does anything. So we'll get some, uh, on, see what it does on a car that's pretty much stock, the exhaust, everything's untouched. Literally the only mod is that intake and the ATI pulley. This is the gains on the uh, ported intake with zero tuning. Stock throttle body. I'm going to slap the uh, bigger throttle body on to see what we can get. It's pretty impressive. I ain't gonna lie, we're testing this because I was always not completely sold on doing the, the intake with the stock throttle body. Uh, so I've never tested it. I've changed my mind. Changed my mind. Who wants intakes done? Come get them. Conclusion, intake was definitely worth some power. Uh, bigger throttle body was not. JLT didn't make any more than what my current setup did, so I didn't show any of that stuff, but we did multiple pulls. I'm not going to take, you know, video of every single pull, but did multiple pulls, got everything warmed up. Total, we did like 15 or 16 pulls in about 45 minutes, maybe a little bit more. But um, made sure, you know, everything was fully up to temp. And uh, the intake showed between 13 and 15 horsepower between two pulls. And uh, it was definitely pretty cool i was like man if i see five horsepower i'd be happy on a you know a stock car i didn't expect to see as much as we did with a stock throttle body um i always thought the bigger throttle body on a stock vehicle was worthless and um definitely proved that it, it gained zero so next step put a cam in this thing i'm gonna do cam only with um some stainless works mids no port work on the heads and see what it's worth on pump gas but we have to baseline it on the new dyno before i can move forward with that and then uh hopefully some decent tack track times in a couple weeks so that's the follow-up sub if you want more of this bs